The porcupine is not intentionally destructive. It's simply trying to locate a source of sodium, in this case, salt from human sweat. The tree bark, leaves, and plants of porcupine ingests contain massive amounts of potassium. In order to rid its body of excess potassium, its kidneys also flush out essential sodium. Sodium cravings are the most intense in pregnant or nursing females and can result in particularly risky behavior. This female porcupine is challenging the most dangerous predator in her environment, a human being. Although the owl is usually nocturnal, it sometimes searches by day. But this owl is hunting dangerously near a red-tailed hawk's nest. When the hawk has a family to feed and the sun is shining, it will not tolerate the presence of the owl in their shared territory. By night, the owl would have the advantage. Now the hawk, a much faster flyer, climbs high into the air, then drops to deliver the message. Speed is one of the hawk's primary weapons. It may reach a hundred miles an hour in a dive. Powerfully, repeatedly, the point is driven home. The owl is surely ready to leave by now, but if it tries to fly, it's slower than the hawk and will surely be hit in mid-air. Finally, a chance to escape. The hawk is the clear winner, and the owl will probably not hunt here in daylight again. This sort of territorial confrontation often takes place in the wild. For instance, the red fox can be a worthy adversary for the hawk when it comes to catching a cottontail.
matter what the time of year or what part of the country, rabbits are among most pursued of all prey, which accounts for their short lifespan, averaging only four months. Even in the swamps of the southeast, the rabbit is the prey of choice. Hunters spend more time and money trying to bag rabbits than all other types of game combined. And the swamper poses some special challenges for even experienced hunters. The hefty six pound swamp rabbit will take to the water like an otter to throw these beagles off the track. Thank <laughs> you. 